One of the most popular online tools for communication is Slack. It does a whole lot of awesome things for personal and business use. In this video, we want to go over how to quickly make a custom Slack reaction using PicMonkey. In the lower right hand corner of your text box, you'll notice a smiling emoji icon. When you click on it, you will see all the emojis already available for you to use as a reaction. In the top right, you will see the Slack icon, which will take you to all the custom images or GIFs available to use. At the bottom, you will see where you can start the add your own process. You will redirect where you will find the add custom emoji button. This is the important part. Your custom image will work best as a square, which is under 128 kilobytes. So let's hop over to PicMonkey. I'm going to create a new project, choose blank canvas. I want a square and the custom default is already a square. So we're good to go. Name your file and create. For my custom emoji, I'm going to use one of PicMonkey's original social media graphics. Keep in mind, whatever your emoji ends up being, the finer details could be lost because it ends up being so small. The simpler the image, the better. I'm going to scale it to the edges of the canvas so it will fill the space as much as possible. I'm going to remove the outline and yellow heart because they will probably be hard to see once my image is tiny as a Slack emoji. Then I'll make my background transparent as a personal preference. Do whatever you like best for your custom creation. Once we export, this is where we will make sure to meet Slack's size requirements. I use the percentage sizing option to quickly test what will get me below 128 kilobytes. and save. Now we'll upload our image and give it a custom name. Once you save it, you can use it right away in a Slack message by typing a colon then its name. And you can now also use it as a custom reaction. Have fun customizing your Slack channel!